Today is the 11th January 2022. So, hello everyone. So, we got like um, really good looking, really good looking market this morning. So, SB500 is going up a little bit, like 10 point. And also, oils and gold, so that's about 10 to 27 points. It's healthcare, and we got like 1% stuff in information technology, 0.1%, and communication service, 0.02%, and energy is to drop a little bit, 0.27%, and finance, 0.30%, and real estate, 0.59%, and consumer, utility, material, or industry, all those stocks drop a little bit just like around 0 0.6 to 0.5% but metals up 0.84% energy up and in the K finance currencies grains soft and livestock let's look pretty good on the screen and we got like uh, start recovering in the technologies systems like those technology will going up and especially we can see those corn as america is went up a little bit and with and soybeans and current coffee everything since going up today but remember it's in the process and the process still going even though they go up a little bit but after like around one or two it's still pulled out really bad and the first stock we take a look today is FTI. FTI is it's not the U.S. stock; it's England. So the beta is two point one, and you can see look the way they will go down a little bit. But if you want to buy it, try from. 10 to 50 share in the first order and buy it down always that's the rule and every day volume about 5 to 15 million dollars so we can see that in on the model ray we get seven buys and we can see like on the system they recommend like you have to buy from 6.70 Eight down to six point sixty eight, and the next one is six point fifty six and six point forty eight. That those should the four orders we should set. They get a little confusing for some people. The kind of like drop a little bit, but look at the um, the market cap is the cap is around three or four billion dollars that's pretty good and especially keep them closer to six and you make more money around six or six on the system they say six forty some but it would do like six a six twenty and now we can see the um, FTI life map now they go close to six twenty How up to six twenty five and now they go close down to six six dollars. That's why I say when you keep them close to six dollars, even though they under sick a little bit them they still won't hurt anything, but the way you make profit is more. It's really stable from December thirteenth to December second to go under uh, six dollars and from December 2nd to uh, December 22nd to December 31st I go over six dollars and December 31st about January 10th is over six dollars six 
support five. Doesn't mean you can hold up like around a week and you make like uh, 80 cents at least. So the second one we go to look today is the NGA, the Zynga. A Zynga is get crazy, like really good looking cap and get 9.4 cap. The Zynga usually have just around seven billion dollars and now they got like almost 10 million dollars like 9.5, 9.6 and 9.8 so cap just moving around and Zynga got uh, in analyzed rating we got like 13 strong buy that's mean a lot a lot 100 hundred thousand thousand people buy it and when we see I just like to look at the beta number 0 0.14, it's not that bad. So now uh, we need to see, like, we can buy from brain now is 8.44, go down to 8.24, 8.05, and 7.71, and we can sell them around $8.77, or around 9 nine ten nine. 2930 yep because when we take up around 20 about 20 30 cent and of course when we sell it we add 20 or 30 cent back so we can see look at the right map the map on the right hand is going down a little bit even though it's going to go down to around six point yeah even though but so right now Jenga make really really good business but you will never know just be prepared because anyway and we buy in the third layer we are going to sell it on the fourth that's what ever the the map of what everyone is looking right now so those information space actually American market today look pretty good. And even though the sale outstanding is just like one point one but it's not it's not that a big deal. But the annual sale is one point nine million dollars. And the income drop a little bit, but the cap increase. That mean the cap up, V one up, V two like halfway. It's like moving around. It's not fully perfect recommendation, but like when when I say V two perfect recommendation is have to be five million dollars. And especially one more thing we need to the analyze rating and thirteen recommend buying and touching recommend buying is a lot of people buy it when a lot of people buy it of course they increase those really really good and spend especially going over a year is 300 percent that's we should take a look and r b l x is kind of like symbol would zinger and they get like gain up like 21 percent so we need to focus and when the stock relate to because sometimes we can choose and we can buy some even though we sell on the same day or sell tomorrow so the we can see compare with on January 10 is Jinga went up 40 percent but anyway Jinga is a really really good 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 company we should focus we should do more research because Jinga the way they make um, every about three to six months Jinga gain around 2B $2 billion on their cap 
this is uh, it's a little scary but because we throw our money on stable stock we don't we make really good money thank you